Hello everybody, Swift here again with another backpack here run. And today I got the conduit as a rare item. So I guess we're gonna do the spell building build or something like that. So what the conduit does is adjacent and diagonal structures become conductive and diagonal, right? Become conductive. This item is conductive, this item is heavy and uh, it gets block. It, it gives you block for each adjacent structure. It also gets one block generation. So this is gonna be a building build pretty much. Pretty much. Uh, and also a spell build, like a spell building build, something like that. I don't have my hopes that up that high. Honestly, I believe that this is not really something crazy, but uh, it's something unique and maybe it's going to be insane. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something, you know. Maybe the whole idea is that you can have a bunch of block all over the place and still not have any problem with, uh, you know, conductivity. Maybe that's the thing. This is heavy, right? I can't even see right now. Doesn't matter, we're gonna continue with what we always set up here. Let's pick up a bunch of mana whenever we find the, the chance to. And then uh, later, later hopefully we're gonna use that. Uh, let's go Poison to all, just for a bit of a quicker fight. Let's go here to use the key. No reason not to. Uh, for now I'm gonna try to level up a couple of, well, you know, try to get a couple of levels here. Before we start trying to uh, pick up the chest and stuff. No classics. Mark one shields twice. Let's hope we find some buildings, first of all. Let's hope we find some buildings. That's the most important part right now. Now, the main thing with this conductivity and stuff is that, well, I don't know what exactly to use conductivity for. I mean, there are a couple of things that care about conductivity, but most of the things don't really. So uh, it's pretty much only spells that care about conductivity, as far as I know, at least. Uh, damage knife, energy, why not? Is this conductive shield? Yep, okay, we got our first thing to gain. To use, I guess. Uh, this is gonna be useful if I throw with the buckler. I could also go for region as I'm missing life right now. So let's just go. Uh, let's fight. Rat wolf and slime. Just take the region right away. Also just use this. Just to make everything a bit faster. We'll heal at the end of the day. Let's not forget that I have a pocket shielding here if I need to. Yeah, I can just use this twice. Easy enough. I guess the main uh, the main reason why conductivity on this... May, uh, the main reason why this makes buildings conductive, I would assume, is uh, because they want you to, you know... Uh, so that you are able to surround the conduit with a bunch of building pieces. I think that's the only logical explanation. Can I get my buildings, please? Can I, can I get, like, a building? Explosive arrow. Okay, game. Okay, game. I want to go imagine this game's like, yo, get a rare arrow. Maybe you want to go archer, you know? Maybe just, you know, maybe no. <laughs> let's get the poison dagger. Let's get this thing. Maybe let's get the machetto. Three damage to everybody. Instead of ten damage. Hmm. Ten damage is also good. Spikes. Will I go to spikes? Oh, uh, it might be. I mean, I have no idea how defensive this is going to become at the end of the day. Uh, but I do believe that this is better now. Let's, uh, let's go next fight. Maybe we're gonna become a spike build. Who knows? Who knows? Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Okay, this is dead. Uh, sorry for the sorry for the pause there on my wording. I was reading something in the side, you know. A notification came in. I'm expecting something. Uh, a call today. So there is a chance at some point that I'm just gonna be like, "Whoops, guys! Pause time." <laughs> Whoopsie. Recording is a real life thing that actually has real life, uh, you know, timely consequences. <laughs> Let's go here, I would say. I don't think I need anything else. Getting double poison blades is decent. Uh, might as well go here. So poison blade, poison blade, shield. I think I could have assassinated. Yeah, I could have assassinated. Wow. Misplays. Uh, well, now I can go Poison Blade, Poison Blade, Shield, Shield, Shield. I mean, I don't have energy for anything else other than spamming the shield right now. Poison Blade, Poison Blade, Slam. Seven Poison. At this point, the enemy is obviously dead. Poison Blade, Poison Blade, Smack. Very nice, very clean. Very quick, too. Uh, let's go this side. Maybe we're gonna go Mage. I mean, it's the same thing. I can just flip-flop these around anyway. I got my first brick. Very nice. We got our first brick, let's go! Now the run is on in on in order, in action, I don't even know. Uh, let's start going through events for a bit of rage gain. Okay, definitely on Archer. 
I mean, imagine if we gain plus rage and we don't have a good weapon right now to use it. Oh, this guy often gives us wands and stuff. Ooh, money. Okay, we can get the hat if we want. Okay, we get a curse. Lose to life. Can I get money, please? Are you kidding me right now? Ooh, when a wand kills an enemy, add four energy. Okay, so I either get this or the money. 50-50. Okay, I get the money. I think this was the money. Yep, nice enough. I obviously would prefer the other one, but money is good too. Uh, let's throw away the energy. Let's get the money gain. Yeah, I enjoy that. Let's go see what we find in treasures. Treasures we find. Nothing of importance. Great luck is good and all, but uh, first of all, let's definitely switch this around. I might as well get the great luck. I don't really want this. Although if I go to a shop, maybe. I don't know, let's keep the great luck. Let's go to the shop first. Because this is just going to give us max life. Maybe the shop gives us a wand or something crazy. Okay, the... Oh! This is really, 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 really good. With what I'm trying to build. Uh, three energy for this. And I need a couple more. One. Uh, I would say two. Okay, because I can find this again. And three. Pretty simple. And I'm going to take this book. This book is pretty important in my mind. For spell builds. Uh, now, you might disagree, but... Yeah, that's on you. <laughs> I believe uh, books, the, the book specifically is pretty decent. And now I cannot afford the healer at all. Now, uh, we are weaker for a bit. We are weaker for a bit, don't get me wrong. But still, we have a good setup for uh, if and when. If, when, I don't even know. If slash when we're gonna actually get... Let's uh, smack the Sable here by reducing its damage. And just skipping the first turn of attack. Yeah. And now, theoretically, I should be able to club him down to non-existence. Two, and shield. Yep. The more I smack him, the less chance he can smack us. One, two, three, done. Now he cannot attack us anymore. Very nice. I could have poisoned him to maybe destroy him faster, but I don't know it would do any difference. Organize for gold. Uh, debuff potion, I would assume. Healing potion and a pasta. Energy and block. I think, yeah. I think, yeah. Uh, energy, actually. Okay, let's throw away this. Let's keep the energy in block. Let's go here. I want to pick up my uh, mana. Like, as much mana as possible. Because I don't know what wand or what spell I'm gonna use. So, it is gonna be important at some point. Let's not forget that I can use this and then shield. This is 2 energy, 4 mana. And 4 mana is 16 shield. Yeah, I should have this closer to my weapon so that I can use my weapons too. Uh, let's get first rid of this guy. I would say. So, let's just spam everything. Now I have 12 shielding, so I will not get hit here. And this guy is almost dead from poison already. From poison alone. Okay, that guy's dead from po Nope, he's not. Now he's completely dead. 10 damage incoming. Shield, shield. Uh, done. Yep, now this guy's gonna shield and she's gonna attack. Let's eat the food. Smack, smack. And the uh, shield and smack. Nice, she's dead. Very nice. The shield, uh, there was no reason for me to shield, but... Does it really matter? I don't think so. We got all the time in the world to do what we want. Do what you want to. The pirate is free. Do. Oh, red pirate. Yar. Har. I mean, I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's continue. <laughs> Let's continue. Definitely not advocating for anything. Uh, I mean, we got a King Cleaver here. Could it be a Cleaver build? Honestly, I'm thinking about throwing away the Buckler and just put this in the middle so we get a little bit of a damage boost. And get this. And uh, might as well get this, I don't know. Let's swap these so that this buffs these. Let's swap these even further so that this buffs both of them. Uh, while this dagger is going to be the weak dagger, quote-unquote. Yeah. I mean, theoretically, I can reorganize better, but right now I don't really care. I, 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 I'm still pretty far away from the actual build that I want to go with. Slime. Okay, we need to get rid of this guy. Uh, let's go energy and block. Smack, 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 smack. Okay, this guy's dead. This guy's not gonna hit us. And the rest are just the double slime fight. Like, we should easily be able to handle that with uh, one shield per turn. And then I would say we go here, here, and here. Yep, that guy's dead already. And now this guy's also gonna die. Hop, hop, hop. And the shield. And dead. I mean, heal first and then poison. Yeah, okay, alive, I guess. But still. Not really for a long time. And we got another brick. Let's throw this away. Let's continue gaining free defense. And I also got a Cursed Blade. I have a Cursed Blade run already. Maybe another time. Maybe another time. For now, let's get the energy. Swip it around here. Nice. Everything is slowly becoming better and better. 
Not sure if there was a key there. Okay, uh, let's just go through. And shield. As simple as that. Got the pocket broken ring. I still have not found any <laughs> uh, wands. The game is uh, playing with us, as always. Want well, the lucky ring? Um, no, I think I, I keep what I have. Uh, for, for when the wand comes, I want to have everything ready. Most likely, I'm going to throw away the club when that happens. I mean, most of these things are going to get thrown out. Let's go shop first. Maybe he is selling a wand. He is not selling a wand. Classic trash shop. Uh, he is selling a key, though. He's not selling a key. And I had a key, though, but we threw it away. Archer is useless. I don't even know why I talk to these guys. I should just be like, oh, Archer, buy. Okay. I, same thing for this guy. Like, just, just buy. I knew what this guy wants. He either wants a uh, food for a cleaver or he gives you food for money. Both of them are mediocre choices if you don't go cleaver build. And a food build does not exist by definition. Uh, let's go just with poison. I'm not going to use the weakness. As uh, the weakness will pretty much, although it will reduce the damage it does, it, it doesn't really matter. It's like theoretically free damage, but not actually free damage. Okay, we continue. At some point, I will just be shielding. I mean, he still doesn't do anything. I mean, I can... Sl sl yeah, easy enough. It's a win. I don't need to explain anything else. Three spaces. Uh, let's go this side. So I maybe put something here. At the end of the day, I can just push everything around. What is this? All weapons get this effect applied when adjacent or diagonal armor or shield is present. This item gets disabled. I mean, yeah, I can just throw this away. Plus six damage on everything. I would like to go for the mana stone region, though. Add two mana to connect the mana stones. So this all wands get this effect applied on use. This item gets disabled for one turn. It's conductive. And when a wand is used, add two mana to connect the mana stones. Uh, when a man when a wand is used when a wand is used oh wait a minute that means that if you have for example five wands you use all the wands once and then you gain a bunch of mana and then you just spam the broken ring or something else but, but what could i use that's not a wand that does a bunch of damage with mana though that's the thing because you have to have something that makes sense here okay first of all this is insane but for now, let me pause here for a moment and uh, re-roll so that I get the mana region thing. Okay, and I'm back. So I didn't find the other thing I mentioned, but I didn't find the windmill. And because the windmill adds one energy to us, I can use this twice. Therefore, this windmill pretty much makes this thing have uh, give us 8 mana instead of 4 mana plus 1 energy. So we're gonna go with the windmill for sure. So I can use this twice so that this gives us 8 mana so I can, you know, chain into each other. Uh, now we will reorganize here just for a moment. Here, that's it. Don't really need to do anything. This stopwatch is also really good. And also the other cotton thing I had was also really good. And then the mana region thing is also good. Uh, but I think this game provides us with more mana. Because the plus three mana would pretty much provide us with three mana plus one energy. While this reduces our energy by one, but increases our mana by four. I'm not sure if I will need the energy at the end of the day. I found my first one, and it's an electric one. It's a pretty useless one. I also found the assassin's dagger. Um, do I want to do an Assassin's Dagger run right now? Honestly, no. I want to do my spell one. Okay, so we got a wand. We got a wand that does 7 mana attack damage. So we don't need this anymore. The Poison Dagger is also pretty decent. So might as well keep it for now. But I need to somehow fit this wand here. So we're going to go here. And then we're going to flip flop this. And perfect. And now this doesn't do that much damage though. I can make this better. I can make this better. Yeah, that's better. So we have the wand to spam, but at the same time we also have the double daggers. Uh, once again, Assassin's Dagger, maybe another day, maybe another day. I don't know, man. It is pretty early, but you need to get this a lot earlier. Like you, get, you need to get this in Act 1 or Act 2. Like right now it's already a bit too late. When I say Act 2, I mean Act 1, like in Room 1 or in, in Floor 1 or in Floor 2. You have to find it pretty early, in my opinion. Now, if, if other people have tested this with the Assassin's Dagger and went better... Uh, then uh, okay more power to them and i also need to yeah i need to reorganize here for sure for sure uh just smack actually what am i talking about we will most likely die for just smack also i should not use the daggers really dead okay let's press this button shield one actually there was no reason to shield oh this gives four armor yeah i forgot okay i need to just get used to this for a bit Need to get used uh, on what's happening for a bit. Let's shield here twice just for safety reason. 
gonna reorganize a bit better in a moment. So here, here. Shield. This is eight damage. This is ten damage, but this can do more if I put it next to. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna reorganize here. Okay, so let's let's do this. Okay, now uh, now the idea is, I press this as many times as possible. Then I press this. This gets buffed up. I press this another a bunch of times. I press this buffed up again and again and again. Uh, I don't want to use the daggers. Like this gets plus two damage and this gets plus two damage. But if I press this button, I gain four mana. That means I can use this four times. Okay, that costs two energy. This is used once for energy. So I can, with two energy, I can either use, I can either use this and this, okay, once, or with two energy, I can use this four times. So by definition, this is better because this is going to be doing, you know, the same, the only difference between these two, like the blade does nine and this does eight. So the damage is, the difference in damage is one. This also adds poison, which is another two on top of that. So this does three more damage, but this attacks two more times. So that's by definition better. So we will throw these both out. They will no longer be needed. I can guarantee you that my math is correct about what I'm talking about. I will get the lucky ring or maybe uh, more pickups, you know, for maybe more pickups. And I can also have this here because when I'm spamming the words rule or the book, I'm going to gain more and more uh, damage for free. Is there a key though? No, there is no key. Let's go event. Actually, no, let's go fight. Ooh, we went into a bad fight. Let's explode here. Uh, well, can I assassinate? I'm pretty sure I can. So this gives us four energy. One, two, three four and now we're gonna press this uh this does five damage this does ten one two three four press this again the reason why i'm counting accounting is because i don't want to uh lose damage from the reason uh, 12 damage per pop we have three pops it's done because the earlier i press the warrior's book the more damage we get through this it's better to uh use four energy and then press the book then use all my energy and then start pressing the book I hope it's understood why, and I don't need to explain further. Let's go on. I mean, if I'm going to pick something up, might as well pick up a consumable. Let's go fight. I'm going to do a crossbow man. Crossbow man got a shield. Uh, let's throw the shiv into the shield. And explosion. And then one, two, three, four, four. Energy. Two, three, four. Energy. One, two, three. Done. Nice, 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 nice. I'm super happy that I'm so powerful. Let's go. The run is now in actual order. Now, now, now the run exists. Now we are going places. Oi, 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 oi. Do I want to... My rare item, whatever. Okay, he gave us trash. We're gonna take... What is this, first of all? Adjacent and dialing weapons good form positions. Okay, this gets destroyed at the end of the fight. I don't even need to take the damage. Both of these are, in my opinion, useless. Uh, he... Oi, 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 oi. He was a bit sad there at the end. He didn't help us out. Uh, one, two, three, four, hoppity poppity, one, on purpose, three, three, four, hoppity poppity, one, two, done, and we didn't even get the poison damage, whoa, we got two bricks and a citrine, okay, you're out, there's no more room for you, citrine over here, um, we can put the bro brooks, we can put the brooks, <laughs> Come Yep, now we gain even more blocking, this is not in a good spot, we can have this here, this is conductive, this can be here, this is also conductive, this can be here. We're flip-flopping things quickly. Let's not forget that every single brick is conductive, so mana stones do actually work through the bricks. That's that's the point of this. That's the point of this. That's the point of the bricks uh, being conductive, so that you don't care about where your building is. Like, you can just have a building wherever you decide to, the game doesn't care. When a diagonal shield is used, is this a shield? Accessory. Would be nice. Anyway, let's go. I see the six mana stone there, but I don't think it's important. We are going to get rid of the Chris guy. Not that any of these two is going to survive, but whatever. One, two, three, four, power up. One, two, three, four, power up. One, two, three. I'm sorry, I'm counting like this stupidly, but that's pretty much how the whole fight is going to go. I'm not going to be, you know, counting everything stupidly. <laughs> the fights are most likely going to go this way. Uh, I would say let's go here. Most likely we're just going to add more mana stones and more mana stones. In general, the middle space is where we care about to be in. What is this? Is this plus damage on wands? This is uh, wands in this column gets plus damage. Yep, exactly. That's right. Okay, so we're gonna go here. So now this does one more damage. Not that it's something insane, but it is what it is, you know. Uh, this is the left glove, right? Yep, so this is also three block. Also, it is what it is. Hatchet, five damage for free. Nope, not five damage for free. Forget that part. Uh, I could have this somewhere fit. Throw this away. 
bit this here. Now, wherever I'm pressing this thing, this also gets damaged. Yep, and I have the shield here in the corner. In general, I enjoy what we're having. Let's go here. Let's see what we get. Max health, why not? We have the money. We are pretty much rich at this point. Piggy bank, man. You just pick up the piggy bank and within one floor, you have already 25, 30 gold. Like, it's if you see a piggy bank in the shop, always pick it up. Is this ranged? Well, we got a problem. This guy gets... On take damage, gets... Oh, we, we got a real problem. Uh, okay, shield, 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 power up, shield, 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 power up, and we're gonna go with one, two, three, can I kill? Four, five, six, done, nice, 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 oh, ho, 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 the golden redstone, yeah, but I don't want to throw it on the electric wand. Okay, we definitely take this, but we don't throw it on the electric wand. Let's be serious here. We're going to find... We definitely are going to find a better wand than that. The rest, though... The rest, I don't know, man. Here, let's take the damage knife. Who cares? Who cares? Let's go wherever. I'm going to find a better wand, man. I believe in my luck. Believe in my luck. Might be wrong about it. Doesn't matter. Let's throw away the shivas. No matter what, it will always do less damage than the wand. One, two, three, four. Power up. One, two, three, four. Power up. Poverty, poverty, poverty. Uh, throw this away. And let's, in general, throw that away. And we won. We are very powerful. Ooh, we got a roof. Insane. 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 Okay, that one damage is not going to do a big difference. So I'm thinking about throwing this away. Uh, and uh, the spaghetti for now can stay, I guess. These are going to become the roof. Boop. Look at this. Everything below this gets buffed. Uh, well, if I want to make this actually better, I should make sure that it's something like this. Because this gets adjacent and diagonal. Gives them plus one, right? For each adjacent structure. Oh, only adjacent. Okay, then down here I would guess is better. Although this gives plus one to everything below. So, theoretically, it should be something like this. Okay, now this says four block. This is four block. If you put it like this, this is one block and this is five block. Obviously, this is better. Uh, now the magic stuff is gonna be here in the corner. All of these are conductive. Let's not forget that. And let's have the shiv over here. Yep, I think we're pretty decent. Uh, let's put this here so it buffs the wand. Uh, this is not really needed. The cap is not really needed. And if anything, having caps is reducing our power. My first wand is definitely something I want though. I definitely want uh, another wand. Maybe throw away the shiv. I mean, shiv is good and all, but still. We need a bit of room for a couple of things. This gives damage to, to weapons. Okay, the, 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 the my first wand is not a weapon. This can go here, this can go here, and the wand can go here. It is connected with the rest. Uh, yeah, it is connected with the rest. I mean, if anything, let's just have it here so there is a less chance of making a mistake. So now I got two wands. I'm really thinking about uh, how many more wands I would need to get the... I think the I think the, the mana stone... So, there is a relic. Maybe I'm gonna do another build with that. Like, the relic we previously found, the one that says that I can use a wand once per round, but uh, it gives us two energy every time I use it. I feel like that build is you have ten wands and only one triple mana stone. Like, only one conduit. And then you pretty much always maintain your energy at two. Like, no matter what happens, you, you you keep the energy at the point where you want to keep it at. Uh, that, that's just an assumption, by the way. Like, that might not be true. If anything, it might be completely wrong. Let's get rid of this guy. No. I mean, I, I'm kidding. I have 19 armor. <laughs> but still. Let's go. Nice, clean. Okay, we got our lucky ring. I mean, it's better than the it's better than the spaghetti. And energy, one energy is pretty much useless to me. Let's go another lucky ring. Maybe we're gonna go a wand. Most of the wands are rare and higher. At least the good ones. I obviously would like to get a metallic wand, as that's one of the highest higher DPS ones. Shield, 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 buff, attack, 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 buff, attack, 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 done. Nice. I didn't get a wand here. I did get a two mana stone though. Uh, I would say we throw away the lucky ring. In general, lucky rings are okay and all, but uh, yeah, we mostly care about this. I really hope we're gonna find a better one than the electric wand right now, but whatever. Uh, I mean, I don't have a shift, so just begin. Just begin. One, two, three, four. Do this. It's gonna pretty much be always the same. I really enjoy the fact that we got more mana. I hope we gain even more. Ho, 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 we got our brick. Well, this brick is gonna join. I would say. Let's throw away the other lucky ring. 
Should I throw the lucky ring away or should I throw mana stone away though? Now this is where we have arrived at. Let's throw his lucky ring away. Let's continue with the buildings. With the buildings, let's uh, actually make it so that this is on the left. So I want this here. Therefore, this can be here. And uh, this... Yeah, I mean, let's just make everything correct. Nice. So next fight. I still am waiting for a better one for the whetstone. I'm not sure if it's a good idea. Rage. Well, the time has come. Uh, it's over. This is an electric wand build now. I mean, we just got rage on this and there, there is no way to change that up. So th there is also no reason to uh, try to uh, stick to the, oh, I want to buff this, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, guys, it's just not happening. I wanted to get a better wand. The game didn't give us a better wand. It is what it is. We're going to go an electric wand build. The, the simplest one that exists in the game, literally. Because I want to be using this now that it gives us rage. So let's use this on this. Spam attacks. One, two, three, four, I guess. You know what I want to do? Just reorganize, take this over here. Not sure if that was a good idea, but whatever. Let's uh, let's keep our mana low. Let's not use all our mana for no reason. Buff us. One, two, three, four. Buff us. Two. I should only use all our mana when uh, when the time has come to assassinate, you know. When the time has come to like, okay, we have enough damage to kill, let's kill. Otherwise, I should not use all my mana. Four here. One, done. Done. We won. We won. Nice. Okay, uh, I didn't get anything that I want. So, what is this? Old Worms Glyph Effect and Use Items. Can I go? Okay, I didn't find anything I want. I'm gonna go with the uh, reroll here. So, uh, let's see what we're gonna get. Actually, let's do the reroll while it looks like this. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I didn't find what I asked for, but I found this, the Conductor. Like, literally, the next fight is what I got this thing. Once again, this, I'm pretty sure, is for a multi wand build. All wands get this effect applied, and use this item gets disabled for one turn. This item is conductive. When a wand is used, add two mana to connect to mana stone. So you have one big mana stone that has like a triple, like you have one conduit, a triple mana stone, and then you have like a million wands, and you're like, I use this one, and 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 this one. I want to do that build at some point, but not right now. Conduit is what we're going to get. Connected weapons get 25% bonus damage. I mean, it's literally just 25% bonus damage on this thing. Is that good? I'm not sure. I mean, the thing is that Warrior Spellbook is buffing this, so it is good. Let's go with Conduit and uh, let's throw away a symbol mana stone. Here you go. All of these are connected anyway. Everything is a conduit. And this needs to go over here. Yep, all of these are still connected. Like every single thing is connected. The only thing that is not connected is this. This, this, and this. Like I have four items that are not conduit. Everything else is. And I'm even thinking about throwing away the piggy bank for one. I mean, you know what? Now, let's first find big, bigger mana stones and then we're going to think about throwing away the, that thing because a one mana stone is a joke. Anti-poison, not really that useful. Anti-spikes would be useful. Maybe I should have tried to get a, a what is it called, the lighter, the, 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 I don't even know, man. I don't even know what it's called. Let's go. Trade food for cleaver. Yep, that, that was a choice. Do I have even food? I don't even have food. So that isn't even the NPC I thought it was. <laughs> the trade food for cleaver. One, two, three, four. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Here we go. And you guys are dead. Look how much damage we do. And the more mana we find, the faster we're going to be able to get more damage. Uh, let's go this path. Here, here, and here. I want to, you know, be able to create a mega structure. Uh, one block down there. First of all, we got a triple mana stone. Insane. And secondly, we got two bricks. Here and here and pop. And now we already like this gives us four. This gives us four. This is insane. This doesn't this never gives you something, by the way. It says each turn adds your block, but it's just in case you generate uh what is it called? Uh in case you generate uh, haste. Because for some reason, if you if you are hasty, your uh, your buildings give you more defense. You know, the lore in this game does not really <laughs> Uh, work nothing to see no key though right no key i don't even have room for a key by the way the, the later the key appears the better for us two three four one two three four five firing the laser at the end of the round wow we got a brick okay i mean you're out let's join with us with the brick family plus one block on this plus five block on this without it this is four so this this brick adds this brick adds two block to us Two block isn't really that much, but if I got like to get like two or three more bricks. By the way, I'm most likely gonna throw away my first wand. Jason weapons get plus one poison, but minus one damage. Um, on the one hand, plus one poison is good on this because this is gonna apply like ten poison per attack per round. Ten poison isn't really something very small. 
But on the other hand, that plus one attack, this plus minus the one damage, is gonna get multiplied by 50% more or less. Mm, is this still worth it though? I don't know, man. This does not feel worth it. I always say that though. Ah, no, let's, let's, let's not go with poison. There is a key here, I have to say. Do I need the key? I don't think I need the key either. I mean, am I even searching for another wand or what am I even searching for? Like, th that's the thing. I don't know what I need right now. I need, like, unique stuff. Haste. Okay, that's completely useless. Well, once again, the blacksmith hopefully will change. One, two, three, four. Buff. One, two, three, four, five. Buff, whatever, it doesn't matter. Yeah, the damage is the most important aspect here. Oh, we got a triple mana stone. Uh, what's more important, though, is the plus one damage on connected stuff. I think we can throw the piggy wank away at this point. 67 coins is pretty much as much as you need. This is obviously connecting over here. You know what? Let's actually throw away my first one. No, my first one is healing. I can use my first one in combination with the broken ring to keep myself alive for a long while. So let's just throw away the piggy man. Yeah, honestly speaking, I don't really need the money. Like, honestly, honestly speaking. One, two, three, four. Let's go here. Do I even need to buff even more? Let's see. I don't even need to buff anymore. Yep, the more max energy I have, the better. Nothing to see. Uh, is there a key? There are two keys. Theoretically, I can pick up both keys and go open up some doors. Yeah, but the thing is, once again, what am I searching? I'm searching for mana stones. And as far as I know, you find on mana stones only in combats. So there is no reason to go there. I want double, triple mana stones. I don't think about that I'm wrong. I, I could find a, and a couple of other things too, like the robot. You no. Know? One, two, three, four. The broken toy, or whatever it's called. Yeah, I can. I could find some other things. Maybe, maybe I should think about this some more. Yeah, from here on out, I'm gonna try to maybe not play it the way I'm playing it. By the way, we did like 300 damage. Buff, buff, and bye. Bye bye. Let's see what we get. Oh, we got the duct tape! Insane! Insane! The fact that we got the duct tape. Also, two mana. Let's throw this away. Yeah, but what will I use it for? No. <laughs> I don't even know what to use it for. And I also found the ancient tool. I mean, look at this. We literally got the build for it. Do you want to go mage? We had a two mana stone and this, this, and this. Like, literally, we had the mage built here. Uh, what will I use the mana stone for, though? And how would I even use it? Like, does the does this work with these? Four block, four block, five block, three block, four block. I mean, if I put this here, it's still four block, four block. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know how to use the deck with this. What am I even missing? Effects applied to this. I mean... Effects applied to this are passed to adjacent items. I guess with the citrine somehow. Can I make this thing buff the citrine twice? I don't think that's a thing. I don't think you can do something like this. How much damage is that? 9? And now? 12, yeah. So double buff citrine is not a thing. Maybe double buff spellbook, maybe. Yeah, du maybe double buff the warrior spellbook. Is this adjacent and diagonal weapons? Okay, so maybe if I do something like this and I use this, it's going to hit this and the duct tape having this twice, maybe? That's for to connect mana stones. Maybe that's also going to hit it. I mean, I don't know. Because this is weapon. Adjacent and diagonal weapons. It doesn't say... It's, this is all effects apply, so I guess it should work. I don't know. I really don't know. We're gonna have to see and test at the end of the day. And by the way, we got another electric wand for that weird build of having a bunch of wands. Uh, yeah, no idea. I think this only adds two block. is not really that useful. Let's go with one more energy for now at least. And uh, let's see how this is gonna pan out. No clue. The build doesn't feel like a god run that I wanted it to do, to make. Not that it's bad. Did it get more? Where is Spellbook plus two? Nope, it, it only got buffed once. Does this give more energy? I don't think so. One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna see now if it gives us if it gives us more energy. So I'm gonna use it now and see. Come on, enter in. I'm gonna use it now and see. Maybe maybe somehow the duct tape makes it so that it gives double energy. Nope, that's not a thing. Okay, I mean I don't know what to use the duct tape for. Let's uh let's continue expanding on the left, I guess. Maybe if I find some buff in the future, like may maybe I find some buff in the future that makes sense. Yeah, maybe I'm going to find something that gives like buffs to nearby things. I don't know. I really don't know. Different items, same rarity. <laughs> Throw away the duct tape, get legendary, something else. 
Red King, same boss fight, same fight literally. Yeah, this doesn't do anything. Uh, one, uh, not this guy. Two, three, four, buff. One, two, three, four, buff. Two, three, four. I'm trying to min max here a bit. Here you go. And he's dead. Very nice. What is this? What is this? This is another wand, you see? Another wand for the wand build. Creates an ethereal arrow in a space that doesn't come. Okay, this is useless, obviously. When a weapon kills an enemy and three haste. I mean, yeah, that, that is actually really good. That's actually really good. Nothing else, though. Uh, I could go for energy. Yeah, let's go for energy. Maybe for a better burst. Burst turn one. That's a, that's a play. Let's go fight. Okay, I definitely do enough damage. Definitely, definitely do enough damage. One, two, three. I already do 200 damage turn one. Wow. I do 400 damage turn one. Double mana stone. Obviously better than a single mana stone. Obviously better than a non-mana stone. Because, yeah, this gives energy, but it's a one-time thing. This is going to be permanent. Let's see what we get with this. Plus 5 HP. Very nice. Very clean. Queen Blade Master. Ah, that fight is not really that easy, but whatever. 1, 2, 3, 4. Shield. 1, 2, 3, 4. Mana. Maybe shield a couple of times. Tag a couple of times. Shield again. Tag again. Yeah, my 27. I'm pretty decent here. 27 still. 27 still. Ah, maybe could have killed. Maybe could have killed if I was willing to go further down my energy. Easy enough. My shielding is what I meant. If I, want, if I was okay with reducing my shielding more. I don't find anything. Let's take the bog and just sell it. You can take it. Oh, we found Pavis and Buckler. Man, this game today. This item gets plus 7 damage when you take damage. Man, this game today. I could have got Pavis plus Buckler. Oh, what is this? Can be used one time each turn. Adjacent weapons get one healing self this combat. Oh, this is this is actually good. I can heal very quickly, very fast. Although, regen. I mean, regen is also good. Yeah, because two energy, two energy equals four regen. While this is one energy equals, I guess, and healing plus, maybe even more. Yeah, this might actually be good. <laughs> And might also make us throw away the first wand. Yeah, let's throw away the first wand. Pick up the regenerative redstone. This way we have even more room. Or uh, maybe something that will appear in the future. I don't know. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. Also got weapon this column with two arm symbols near this turn. The silence is destroyed. Ah, eh, not really that useful. I could go with uh, Pavis and the little buckler. And then with duct tape, I could do a whole build that is, you know, the, the shield. Use the shield build or something. But, I mean, let's be serious. We're not gonna... Not gonna change the build right now. The build is pretty decent. I like what we are having. Magma Core Finale. Let's go fight with our uh, magic building. The magic building build. <laughs> Look at this. We have like a wall between our items, but because everything is conductive. By the way, we got the bad fight. That is really bad. Uh, I would say we go with Whetstone. Yeah, let's set up the Whetstone. And uh, let's go with transitioning one the one, one the other. Shield, up, 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 up. Okay, shield, shield, shield. Uh, I guess one more shield. Smack. Okay, I think we're enough here. And let's not forget that I don't have any mana regen, so any mana I use now is gonna be mana that I don't use next turn. Let's go here. Smack, smack, smack. Shield, shield. I guess mana. Shield, shield, shield. Done. Nice. Let's go. Okay, I can definitely defeat these guys. Uh, let's go mana. Uh, again. Smack, smack, dead. Smack, 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 dead. Smack, shield, shield. Okay, we're good. In general, the more things he summons, the better for us. Let's also get a bit of healing in. Uh, obviously, the reason why the more things he summons, the better for us is twofold. One of the two reasons is we gain haste. Other reason is that uh, we gain rage, you know, because I'm not forced to attack him again, so I can just focus on getting my rage up. Okay, at this point he has 300 life, so at this point he is in a danger territory. We're doing about 50 damage for smack, so yep, he's dead. Shield a couple of times here, and smack and done. Very nice and clean and a win. 
Uh, now I don't want to reroll, by the way, even if I don't get the mana region item. So I hope I get the mana region item, but I mean, we didn't. We didn't. Should I restart this? Although I just said, when adjacent or diagonal armor or shield is present. I mean, I don't have shield or armor, so we're going to just take this. Yeah, and this now has a bunch more damage. Because let's not forget that this gets 50% more damage. 25 from this and another 25 from the fact that it has a whetstone on it. So that plus... Whatever that, plus uh, 6 damage in reality is like plus 9 or plus 10. Let's go event. That is... Oh, let's see what she sells us. First one, I hate you, man. She, she is still trash. Let's see. <laughs> Uh, what we get. I found another building. I mean, I'm obviously gonna buy the building block here. Not that it's gonna add something crazy to us, but still, it is, you know, shielding. Free shielding is free shielding. We're never gonna say no to free shielding. Plus two damage in a column, also pretty decent. We do have the money, and I think we're good to go. That plus two damage is obviously gonna be plus three damage, because that's how math works. Let's just attack through here. I don't think they're gonna survive. Very nice, very clean, very quick. We got a 2 mana stone. Um, I think that 2 mana is better than 2 damage. <laughs> I know I just get, got this. I know I just bought it. Yeah, why did I just buy that? Also, that 2 mana is also better than 1 damage. The reason why this is better than all of these is because just through the virtue of attacking twice, we will gain 2 rage. And that's gonna improve our damage. I know that this plus 1 is gonna get multiplied by 50%, but it's not gonna catch up to plus 2 damage because it's just 1 damage, you know? So let's throw this away. Let's throw that away. Uh, next target to throw away is most likely going to be the Emerald. After that, this brick down here. After that, we're going to see. I don't know why I bought the Emerald. <laughs> I guess for more burst, but the thing is that, that that doesn't even make sense. The more mana I have is the more burst. As you see, we are destroying opponents. Double slime fight. Let's just go through. Bye bye. I feel like my rage is not building up fast enough. I got another brick. I don't need more bricks. Forget the bricks. The building done. Oh, we got the three I'll want. This would also be insane with uh, only one want per, per use use weapon, whatever it's called. I'm not good at expressing myself. So wait a second. I do 30, 26, 28, 28, 3D. Why, why sometimes? So now I'm about to do 3D again. Wait, what? Why? I do 3D. Next attack, 32. Next attack should be 33. Why is it 32 again? I don't get it. Because at the end of the day, the rage goes up. Look at the end. Do you see that at the end, it's a rage plus 10? That's rage plus 11. That's rage plus 12. So how can it be that the rage goes up by 1? I got a triple mana stone. Okay, we're definitely throwing away the emerald. How? I, I, I really don't understand how the math works. I really don't. Uh, maybe throw away the brick. Like, defense might not be that important anymore. Yeah, defense is not really that important anymore. Not not that, not that this will stay forever. I, I enjoy that we got a triple mana stone. Huge mana stone. Yeah, I got it. Huge mana stone. <laughs> the visual bugs still exist. Let's start attacking. And let's also start shielding. Here you go. Let's go through everybody. W waltzing through them. Oh, they survived. Okay, well, I guess we're gonna die in a bit. <laughs> Excuse me? This is not connected. Damn it. Sift the genius. Sift. A YouTube gameplay player. How, how I somehow succeeded into completely missing that this was not even hitting is unbelievable. <laughs> Okay, well, the, the duct tape is, like, completely useless at this point. Like, completely, completely useless. It doesn't do anything. It has no purpose in being part of this. Man, imagine throwing away a duct tape. Imagine being so busted that having a duct tape is not even that useful to you. Let's go here, and now let's just smack through them. Very nice. I mean, by the way, not... The, the thing I just said isn't even true. Like, I'm not busted enough to not need the, the, the... It's not that I'm busted. That is the reason. First of all, I'm gonna definitely try to get the whetstone there. It's not that because I'm busted. Uh, the reason why the whetstone isn't good. And when I say whetstone, I mean the... Um, what's it called? Man, why, why am I... Right now, I'm getting mixed up. First of all, let's get the dark whetstone. Uh, let's throw away the duct tape. This is, this is not adjacent, right? It is row, okay? And this is also row. 
Adjacent. Okay, this adjacent duct tape is not needed. Honestly. Should I reroll here to maybe get another dark whetstone? If I can use this twice in a round, we're gonna be really good. I believe in my luck. Well, I should not always believe in my luck. How much money do I have? 21. Okay, let's keep it for um, a shop that might be, a, you know, a god shop. Let's go. Okay, for example, now I can do this and this, which is two energy. And I'm like, whoop, 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 whoop. you go down, whoop, 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 whoop. and now I'm reducing the enemy damage. Now, this, this, this might not seem good right now. Uh, let's throw away the emerald for this. This might not seem good right now, but the thing is that the moment we get to fight a citrine, that's three damage. Is it as good as, yeah, as one energy, definitely. It's definitely as good as one energy, that's for sure. Everything is connected, right? This is not connected. Yep, now it is. These are connected. All of these are, yeah, all of these are connected. I don't know why you cannot see what is connected. Uh, yeah, the plan is, for example, I get one weak. And then uh, I make the opponents weak. The whole idea is to survive the Sable fight that's incoming. There is an incoming Sable fight that's gonna assassinate us, you know, not in this area, in the next one. Here I don't need to apply weakness, obviously. I just go through them. I go through them. Nice. <laughs> this is very, very, very powerful. With the build we are having. Uh, should I get it? I think I should. But what will go away? One, two, three. And I guess... No, that, that's really good. And I guess four. I think the time has come to throw away the money. When adjacent armor is present, I mean, yeah, adjacent armor is not going to be present ever. It's like over there and something like this. I think something like this is the play. I'm pretty sure. Now, in case you don't understand why, the reason is that haste is very powerful if you have like a million buildings. So like every two haste is going to be like plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, plus eight armor every turn. Uh, but this is plus two haste, so that means plus 16 armor every time I gain two haste. I get this really good. Uh, I know I'm losing a bit of DPS, but my survivability, I think, might be a bit more important. Five, two, three, four. Yeah, I don't know how important the DPS is. Maybe the DPS is now extremely trash. Who knows? Piggy bank, I don't need money anymore. I don't need anything anymore. Now, I will not be able to increase my max life and neither get the vents. But we already know for a fact that if I don't die to the Sable fight, then we will die to a double Shadows fight. So there is no reason to try to achieve anything. Like, th there is no reason to try anything that um, you, I might have thought would be good. Uh, let's actually... Uh, we can continue here attacking until it goes up to 29. Yeah, but that's good. Let's go. Any damage? Oh no. Let's go weakness application and healing. Yep, now his damage is gonna stay the same forever. I should have been applying weakness from the first turn. And now I can even reduce his damage. <laughs> That's the power of weakness. Look at this. <laughs> now he will start doing less. I found the three mana per, per round. Yep, that's actually good. Um, I guess we throw away the haste regen. Haste on kill. Because uh, uh, there is a reason for this. I'm going to throw away the haste on kill. Because uh, from here on out, I will be killing at most one en enemy. And when I get that one enemy kill, then I, I don't need to have any more. Ooh, we found a crimson energy. I cannot really fit it. And not, I don't even need it. <laughs> so there is no reason to care about it. Let's go onwards. Deep cave one. And here is the first Sable fight that's most likely going to assassinate us. Oh, we didn't get a Sable fight first. That was lucky. Uh, we will assassinate here though. 21 is a kitty numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4. Boom. 1, 2, 3, 4. Boom. 1, 2, 3, 4. Boom. One, two, three, four five. Dead pretty much. I might as well go for the next one too. Look how much damage we're doing, man. Look how much damage we're doing. 500 plus. We do about 800 damage turn 1. In one turn. Ooh, turn. Double energy. Yeah, but there is no room anymore. Uh, there is no room anymore. About anything. I might throw away the defense. Throw 
throw away the defense for even more mana regen for even more damage. I mean, yeah, let's throw away the defense because this is two more attacks. Two more attacks through the whetstone can make us get take less damage pretty much. Let's just go here to cry. Okay, no cry achieved. This guy did not sell us something good the moment we needed it. Uh, yeah, let's go. Four. At the end of the day, none of these two are really gonna do anything to us. And he's dead. Let's go. Boost. Start attacking. Boost more. Very nice. Very clean. We continue winning all the time. I don't know why, why I'm saying very clean every time. For some reason this became uh, something that my mind just decides to say. Okay, here is the Sable fight. Uh, we're gonna go here. And here because why not. Let's go 1, 2, 3, 4... Let's go here. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Okay, the Sable is useless now. We'll continue attacking him. Uh, okay, this this guy does not damage us anymore. So let's start reducing damage from the other guy. Because the only thing that has to happen is to not take too much damage. Zero. Yep, nothing. And 21 from the other guy. It doesn't matter though. We can go one, two, this. And now the Sable is almost dead. Actually, straight up dead. The Sables also does not do anything. And at this point, we are for life. We, we got everything that we want to get. Now we'll even go with double buffs. Easy enough. Bye-bye. Very nice. Very quick. Uh, there is a call right now happening, but that is not the important call. Go onwards. I, I cannot do anything in the healer. Uh, yeah, this fight is just a normal fight. I don't need to, you know, handle the whole, make the opponents do less damage, etc, etc, that I was doing previously. This is just normal attack everybody and be done with this fight. Man, I really like it. I really like it. I really like the door pretty quick. I wanted to increase my attack speed here, but I don't think that's a thing. See, we got a lucky... Oh, we got a triple mass stone. Uh, yeah, we're gonna throw away one of the double mass stones. I'm gonna keep my all my energy regen. Like the only thing I want right now is a bit more room to get more mana stones in, and uh, I'm always gonna pick up triple mana stones and double mana stones. Like I don't need anything else. This is the build. We got the we got the defense through the whetstone. We got the healing through the healing whetstone. Now the only thing that uh, you know we might not have a cover right now is uh, I don't think we're not covering anything. Uh, let's get rid of this guy because he's attacking us. One, two, three, four. Let's go here. One, two, three, four. At the end of the day, I am scaling faster than anything else because I'm not only scaling, I am scaling defense, but I'm also scaling damage at the same time. You know, I'm gaining rage and I'm also scaling damage through the warrior spellbook. So at the end of the day, everything is pretty much scaling us. Everything we are using is scalable. Let's go here too. Let's hope I have enough attacks. Okay, I have enough attacks on the dot, by the way. No, I had. I have more. I think it might have been on the dot. Doesn't matter. What doesn't matter is that we won. Very nice. Once again, nothing really attacked us. Uh, let's continue attacking pretty much everything. Ooh, double curse. Well, the time has come to lose some life. Uh, well, if we're gonna lose life, then might as well go for the double whetstone play. Two, three, four. I know that only one of the two is gonna curse us. I mean, I said I know, but yeah, okay, I was correct. I attacked one more time than needed. I'm gonna take the 16 damage here. We literally set up for this. Let's go. Now this guy is gonna start doing almost no damage. And we are pretty much full as you see. Yep, and just like that we won't lose life. <laughs> this guy does zero. Very nice. Let's buff ourselves up and just go through them. Just eat through them. Just destroy them. Want to see them destroyed. Let's see. Okay. Nothing to find. Not, nothing to see. Mana stone. Not really that important. As I don't have any room. Let's see the valuables. Okay. Pretty nothing. Let's go onwards. Path is blocked. What? Okay. We're definitely gonna get hit here. So once again, we're gonna go for the defensive rod. Let's get the man up. Uh, there is no reason to get hit a million times. Might as well get rid of one of them, and might as well start making the other one do less. We lose a bit of life here. Okay, uh, we're gonna go the same approach, which is the defensive route. Now the front line is most likely gonna do... Yeah, we're gonna take a bit more here, but once again, actually we don't take anything. Okay. And just like that, the defensive route has, you know, came through. 
Now that I think about it, I will I will beat the double shadows fight too. Like right now, the only fight that actually can do anything to us is a poison fight. Uh, we'll go here. Same thing. No big difference. Okay, now we now we can gather money, I guess. And I might as well get the plus two damage. Let me throw away the other time. Although the moment we find mana stones, I'm literally going to throw everything out for the mana stones. Rage, please. Nope, that, that's, uh, that's a useless guy. Let's go fight the hair Apex Kitchener. This might not be an easy fight. We're going to go here and here. Attack. Okay, I think that's already enough. That's already enough. Go here and here. Uh, attack. I am reducing his damage. I'm also taking a bit of spikes. I mean, the spikes don't matter if he cannot actually attack us. Here we're going to pause. And we're going to gain more defense. We're going to increase how much we're going to decrease his stats. You know, because that is at the end of the day the most important part here. And uh, yeah, now we stop completely. We continue buffing these up. And as long as I have shield, I can smack him. He cannot attack us for the rest of this game. Just buff twice, because at the end of the day, I'm not going to use all my attacks anyway. And we won. Buff twice. Yep, we got we got everything. We got CC, we got regen, we got shielding. I think this is a very god... Uh, this is a god run. Like, the only way we're actually going to do, lose... Do's. They actually... I think the only way we can actually lose is uh, if the boss is the, the flame boss. Oh, and poison. Yep, I forgot poison. I mean, I'm kidding. Poison is not going to really affect us. For the double buff route. One, two, three, four. The reason I'm going the double buff route is not because I need weakness. Like, applying weakness is not something that I care about. Getting healing is something I care about. Uh, and because I, you know, because of this lopsided energy we're having, there is no point in, uh, you know, trying to not get the thing done. Like, then, what am I saying? So, uh, I have four energy, right? So, if I use, for example, this thing, but do not use the other thing, then at the end I will stay at one energy because I don't have anything else to use my energy on. Maybe I should uh, make the weakness thing be at the end. Yeah, maybe I should press the weakness thing at the end. Although it's just reducing us by one damage, so who cares really? I want this guy to be a bit alive. He's poisoning us again, are you kidding me right now? Uh, can I even kill him right now? Please don't tell me he's gonna kill us. Oh no. Are we dead? We need poison? Okay, we're not dead, we're not dead. Even more healing. Okay, we're not dead, but we are in a very bad spot. Ooh. Ooh. Let's throw this away. How much damage is this right now? 13 damage per turn to everybody. Yep, that's borderline useless. But it's gonna get improved through the fact that this gives us rage. So we're gonna keep it. It's a little bonus effect, you know? It's a little bonus effect. Everything little helps. If I had 10 robot toys, then maybe. By the way, we requested them to make the robot toy become ranged. Projectile attack or whatever. They still have not done it. I mean, we are still at 17A, so it makes sense that they didn't do it yet. Uh, I will need the whetstone and the healing. So let's just do that. Four. Buff. One, two, three, four. Five, maybe. Pass. Yeah, we're gonna do the same. Buff, buff, buff. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, go. The reason why I'm attacking eight times is because this thing gives us three energy and then another four on this. Uh, let's go weakness, weakness. This guy is about to do the damage. Kitty numbers. And this guy is also not going to do anything. As I said, we, we got a perfect control. The only way we can die is through poison or flame. You know, as long as we don't get poison or flamed, there, uh, there, there is nothing that these guys can do to us. And this continues gaining damage for free. Uh, this guy can also not do anything to us. We will continue gaining the permanent buffs. So now every one of our attacks does more healing, more weakness, you know, more everything. Until we build up enough. And I decide to assassinate them. Let's go here and here. Let's go here. Yep, all of these do nothing. That's enough. I mean, trying to build up a thing here. Weakness, regen, mana, let's see. Okay, that's enough. I don't need to care about them, actually. Like, I don't need to care about them at all. I just attack all the time. And I'm gonna just blast through. Now we begin. Energy. Energy. Just attack the boss. Oh, wait a minute. Don't do anything. Don't do anything. <laughs> uh, this is insane, insane, insane. Pretty chill, the boss isn't even doing anything. Okay, buff twice. Go through the boss. 
Okay, boss still alive. We have 71 rage. We have 10 haste. We get 100 shielding per turn. It doesn't even matter if the enemies actually attack. At this point, like, even if they do 1 or 2 damage, it won't matter. I'm using everything just to be done. And we won. Very nice. Simple, clean, easy. Nothing, nothing, nothing crazy to see here. Ooh. Nothing, any, nothing good, really. <clears throat> Let's throw this away again. More, more mana stone. Uh, yeah, why not? Let's go on. Okay, nothing there either. Let's go. Keep the robot high, obviously. Oh, okay. I think this is the point where we will most likely die. Snake fire, gecko fight, fire, double fire. I guess double fire, gecko. I mean, I'm not sure. I definitely need the region and the dark whetstone. Because I need to make these guys. I mean, these do always go together. I don't know why I said. That is if something changes. Can I do a thousand damage in one turn? I don't think so. But I can reduce this guy damage as much as possible. Okay, uh, I might take 19. I'm not gonna lose my build. Okay, we do the opposite now. Attack this guy. Yep. Because we don't want him to do infinite damage to us. And now we're, right now we're full life. Okay. Uh, okay, now he does nothing plus the burn. I will take 20. Actually, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. 20 plus 24 plus 23 is death. So we are forced to take this. I will throw away some mana stones. Okay. Let's use this. Give him regen. Okay, now I definitely need to get rid of the curse guy. Oh no, I'm stupid. I forgot that shield blocks the flames. Uh, one job, Sift. One job. Pay attention. Pay attention. Okay, let's go. Okay, maybe we can get rid of this guy. Okay, well, shield still protects us, but not for long. I give him region. Oh, ho, 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 we got hit heavily here. You know what? I need to get rid of the guy that's about to burn us. Yeah, because the curse is gonna be 20 something. This burn is gonna be lethal. Borderline lethal. Let's get rid of this guy. No, ho, 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 ho. Uh, yeah, region, rage, whatever. Are we dead? No, we are 22. Throw this away, get one more healing. Okay, we're at 31. We are at very dangerous numbers. I don't think the, 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 the mistake I made throwing away the mana is going to really make a big difference. Olm Snake, Fire Gecko is going to kill us. Let's go Snake Olm. Maybe that's doable. Maybe it's doable. Uh, I mean, I'm going to just do this. And just start smacking. Okay, this guy doesn't do enough damage anymore. So we're going to stop attacking here. Uh, this guy still doesn't do anything. And he will never do. So we just need to get rid of the poison guy. Yeah, we'll always attack the poison guy now. Because the one is attacking our shield, and our shield is also always gonna rise. And the other one is attacking our life. And our life is not always gonna rise. So... Yeah, I can definitely heal me to full. But the poison, yeah. Like, this poison is gonna most likely kill us. Or two. Let's go, please go through, please go through. Nice. Just like that, we are safe again. Need to attack that often. Yeah, we'll just 23 life. Not really that bad. Let's go here. Let's actually do this. So that I have a more powerful healing. Or when I need it. Which is in a bit. Okay, let's do this again. The more powerful the healing is, the higher the chance I'm going to be able to fully heal. Before the next fight, that is. And I'm full. I'm not fully full, but I'm pretty full. Let's go here. Let's go on. I mean, this is non-existent. This at least does something. <laughs> uh, just go to shop to cry a bit. Okay, no cry achieved. Uh, we're gonna try to burst through. We're gonna try to rush as much as possible. There is, I mean, I'm not gonna get this XP until I die. So just, just try to go through the game. Uh, yeah, I mean, we're gonna go with healing. And might as well go with regen too. No, 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 that was a mistake. Oh, I, I threw away a bunch of energy here. 
What is this? Regen? Yeah, might as well. Uh, I mean, yeah, give him regen. What are you talking about? Let's do these again. Let's mag a bit. We're here. I mean, this guy is not allowed to do 3D damage to us. Okay, we got the shield. We should be okay. This is rage. Rage. Rage is also relevant, as I am reducing their damage anyway. Here you go. Let's go buff. Let's go in these two. Okay, I'm out of mana. Uh-oh. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. Rage, again. Pretty relevant. Throw it out. Let's go here. Yeah, now I'm reducing their damage fast enough. As long as it doesn't give me spikes. Regen, we don't care. Definitely better than taking 20. Can I even do enough damage? Kill in time. I don't think I can do enough damage. Why? Oh, I got I got enough damage, nice. 88 flame, by the way. Rage, okay. <laughs> wow. If that guy attacked us with a flame, we would be dead. This is not connected? Or... Oh, wait. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, okay, I have enough mana. Okay, I thought for some reason I'm not getting the mana I was supposed to be gaining. What is this? On tick damage haste. Yeah, might as well. And two energy. Very nice. Let's go onwards. Um, yeah, I, I want to just rush through, guys. I, I don't think we're going to survive long enough to be able to get a level on every kill. So at least let's try to get to the boss. See what this is. Useless. Uh, let's cry a bit on the shop. Uh, we, we do cry at the shop today. Oof, oof, oof. Yes, yes, we do cry at the shop today. If I had this, I could poison myself while also poisoning the opponents. But because I poison myself, I would lose life. And because I would lose life, I would get haste. And also, this costs one energy, so I could use these better. More valuable. Yeah, and also, obviously, a second building on top of the building would be nice. Today was a bad day. 3,000 life. Okay, this fight's gonna be easy in general, though. And the reason for that is because I will be able to stack these two up as much as possible. And then after that, we should not have any danger whatsoever of getting hit by anybody, pretty much. Let's also make this guy a bit more useless. That's enough. These guys cannot attack us. Yeah, let's continue doing both buffs, as I said. Just make opponents useless. That guy's useless. Let's continue attacking the back line. Oh, this guy's not useless. Well, that's enough. I also tried to maintain my energy at a deep, seemingly high number. Here and here. Make this guy useless. Okay. This guy useless. Okay. And this guy useless. And that's it. We can no longer get damaged. This guy has minus 35. This guy has minus 31. Minus 33. Yeah, it's just a no-go. These guys can no longer attack us. At all. Very nice. I'm applying like I don't even know how much weakness to opponents. The Wand of Doom. Mana. Mana. Boom. Yep, you don't do anything. Boom, you don't do anything. Actually, let's start assassinating slowly. Start getting rid of a couple of bosses here. I have 57 rage. I'm a ragey boy. I'm a barbarian. Pass. Let's go again. Energy. Energy. The reason I'm passing, by the way... Oh, what, are you, what do you think you're doing? The reason I'm passing instead of just spamming attacks is because I want to... I don't even know. Is this even value for... I start believing that there isn't any value in doing what I'm trying to do. You know, making that making it so that I use my damage more. How much? 143. Look at this, look at this. 147. 147 damage. And also the rage increases it more and more. By the way, rage got fixed. Whatever the rage problem was is fixed now. Why are you summoning things? Uh hello? Like what are you doing? I want to see if he's going to summon up here and then off to the off screen. You know what? Time to test the bug, you know, before we lose. Oh, no. The This thing <laughs> does 128 damage now. Make this guy not attack us. I mean, he's dead. Now, I want to see where he summons. Please don't summon here, here, or there. No, ho, ho, we had that one there. No, ho, ho, ho. 
So it seems like he summons in front of the other ones. Well, it doesn't matter. Let's just end this. This guy does 22. It's kitty numbers. You know what? I'm gonna wait for him. I'm gonna wait for him. 3d2 damage is nothing. I wanna see if we... Ah, okay. That was your last chance, man. And you blew it. You blew it! You could have you could have had everything, but no. Plus the damage in a row. Sounds good, but obviously it's irrelevant. Queen B and Blade Master. Okay, we're gonna obviously assassinate the Queen B. 40 damage incoming. This guy's crazy. Let's go here and here. Start smacking the B. Let's go here. Yeah, okay, I wanna make the B a bit weaker. Let's maintain our energy. Okay, we're gonna go one and two. Let's make sure all of these are not gonna attack us. By killing them, that is. <laughs> okay, do I have enough energy for the second one? I think I do. Okay. The bee is spawning still. Okay, bee is doing poison. Uh, I do have enough armor to block these and survive. So let's try to get rid of the bee into. Actually, wait a minute. I will not. Sur no, let's kill this first. Let's make sure I'm not gonna die from uh, damage. Like, okay, the bee can poison us, but let's make sure we're not gonna die. Okay, this is not gonna be enough to kill us. I'm blocking all the damage and I'm taking all the poison. Okay. Theoretically, I should be able to kill the bee right now. I mean, she has 980 something life and I have. 50 rage. No! My theoretically was one one attack off. But my calculations were pretty close, I have to say. Like, one attack off is pretty decent. By the way, I'm losing, like, life because the stupid puppet is attacking. The shield. Oh, no, it's the poison. <laughs> it's the poison. Cancel what I said. <gasps> no, I'm kidding. Let's go. Poison is 16. Let's actually stack a bit more healing up here. That will be important. Stack even more healing. Okay, at this at this point, I'm, I am out healing my damage incoming, my incoming poison damage. Okay, so now if the final boss is the flame boss, we just lose straight up. So if we don't fight the king, we're all, it's over. If we do fight the king, then we can easily beat this like easily. Okay, nothing really found. Uh, yeah, as I said, the triple gecko is like instant death. Finale, come on. Honestly, I want to fight the flame boss. It's the king. Okay, that, that, that should be easy. King should be easy. 46 damage. Okay. Uh, do I even want to attack? No, I don't. Because I lose shield. Ooh. Just now I'm plus the damage. This is good. I'm not gonna take it. Because we already gained damage for this. Uh I mean he's not gonna attack us, so now is a good chance to smack him. Okay, pass. I'm gonna smack his allies. <laughs> Maybe not. Shield. Okay, this guy is no longer in danger. And this guy is also no longer in danger. Let's go. I definitely need to increase my power. Up, up. My debuff power, that is. Can you please not do anything? Thank you. Descent pass. This is a free win, man. I mean, not a free win, per se. Here, here, here. Up, you're not gonna do anything. Nice, you're not gonna do anything, and you're also not gonna do anything. And we're slowly not taking damage anymore. Very clean win. Here we go, here we go, do this. Oh, this thing is cursing. Yeah, bye. I wanna deal with curses. Damn it. Well, we're gonna deal with curses. Take 22. I mean, I do have so much healing, it doesn't even matter. Let's continue increasing this. Make this to zero, make this to zero. Make this guy do zero at some point. Yep, and we're full life. And we can no longer lose life pretty much. Okay, now we can just do double this. And just start smacking all the time. Like, it doesn't matter. Oh, maybe it does matter. 
Maybe it does matter. Maybe I wanted to get attacked on purpose to get haste. Huh? Did you think about that? No, did you? Bye. Pass. That's not enough damage. Not even remotely close to enough damage. It's actually gain even more of the reduced enemy damage. Let's make sure I'm not gonna lose. Here we go. Pass. This guy gaining spikes is gonna make this whole ordeal very slow. Okay, I think I want to get start getting rid of, you know, whatever he summons. Because now we do so much damage that uh, getting rid of these things is gonna increase our output in general. Because I will only have to deal with the main boss. Okay, bye. Just attack the boss. 738, 39, here we go, pass. Summon something, who cares? Buff, buff, 1, 2, 3, 4, bye. And attack the boss a bit. Let's not forget that although he has a million spikes, we are scaling defense. And because we are scaling defense, I always can attack him one or two more times. 950, 51. Oh no, we lost life. Who cares? Summons two units. Buff, 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 buff. Go through them as... I just... I almost died by the robot. I almost died from the stupid robot. Wait a minute. My shield protects me though. No! The robot's gonna kill us. The robot is gonna kill us. Panic, 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 panic. And I need to heal up. Oh no, oh no. I, 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 I killed my own run. No, I can't do anything about it. I cannot do anything about it. If I attack, he gains more spikes. Okay, he's at 57. 58. I'm dead. It's over. I cannot do anything. If I attack, I will lose life because I don't have any more armor. If I don't attack... The robot's gonna kill us. Like, we're dead. It's over. <laughs> it happened. Wow. What a bad... Wow. Oh, I should have reorganized and threw away the robot. No! There was a choice. There was a choice. There was a choice. I could have reorganized and just thrown out the robot toy and be done with it and I wouldn't survive. You know what? Sometimes these endings are the endings that uh, let you learn. I enjoyed the run. Once again, I hope you guys don't mind that we lost because of a misplay here and there. At the end of the day, if we didn't die this round, we would have died like a bit later from flames. Because I can guarantee you, and this, and on the next loop, like the moment an opponent that had poison or burn came up, we would die. Right? Because at that point, they do like 3D poison or uh, 3D burn. And then you take two or three 3D burners and like you take 150 damage per turn from burn, you, you don't survive. But still, I made a mistake here and there. I mean, at the end of the day, it's not my fault. It's this stupid thing's fault. I was calculating everything correctly until I did not realize that. For some reason, I thought that this thing attacked after I gained the shield or before I lose the shield from the previous round. But no, it did attack the worst possible moment when I lost the shield from the previous round and before I gained the shield for, for the current round. So it was able to hit me from spikes. I don't know, man. A bit unlucky there. Um, yeah, it is what it is. I like the run. I hope you guys did too. If you did, drop a like. Helps out the channel. Thanks for all the Patreon and the membership supporters. And once again, thanks for watching and see you guys around.